find insight, guidance, and answers. answers. Tune into Spirit with radio medium Laura Lee. Laura Lee. Laura Lee, tuning in to Spirit for my special guest, Marcy. Hi, Marcy. Hi, how are you? I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. Where are you calling from, Marcy? I'm calling from Maridoso, New Mexico. It's got to be warmer than where I'm at right now. <laughs> it is much warmer. <laughs> okay, so Marcy, first impression I get is I get a male that comes into my vision. He's kind of long, lean. I get a sense he's a veteran connected to the armed forces. Uh-huh. I also see an oxygen mask being worn. I don't know if this is him, but I see right. a male wearing it. Does this make sense? Absolutely. I feel like a father figure. Yep. That's my dad. Yeah. He's really close to you. Might have been in the physical as well. <gasps> oh, okay. Now he says there's a major move for you after his passing. And I feel like there's something associated with family as well. I don't know if this makes sense, but he it says that this perfect. this happened after his passing. So it's a big shift. Yes, and we're is. talking major move across state lines, obviously. Are there right. grandchildren involved as well, honey? Um, moving, yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. By the way, you used to talk to him more than you do now. <laughs> yeah, that's true. I see those strobe lights and hear uh-huh. the sirens on, I don't know if this is on top of a cop car, an emergency vehicle. My husband's police officer. <gasps> oh, my. All right. So <laughs> and he has a take-home squad car, so. He knew him, obviously. Oh, mm-hmm. absolutely. Yeah, they he were close. Him. Yeah. Says hello. The other thing he wants to say, I also get the impression somebody has fallen ill in the family and needing special care, medical help. That's true. And so I feel like there's a tie in, even though, you know, you're saying that the cop car with the lights and the siren. But I also feel like there's a tie in with the family member who's needing the special care. Does that make sense to you, Marcy? Yeah. Yeah. The whole thing makes sense. Absolutely. Says this is an emergency and I feel like the family's always on alert. Right. Yep. You're absolutely right. Honey, this isn't COVID, is it? No, it's, um, and actually, I think he's talking about me. I've had, oh. ever since we've been, because New Mexico is pretty high altitude. So okay. I've had the breathing problems and pneumonia, lung problems, and issues like that. So I think that. God me. bless. So have you been rushed in on occasion because of this? Yes. I'm sorry to hear. Well, you got to take good care of yourself. Right. Better care. But this sickness, has it given you ponder of another relocation as a result of it? Yes, absolutely. We're okay. looking right now. Yeah. To go lower. I'll- and you know what? He says, go at once. That yeah. was the message what, I got. Yeah. Okay. And yeah. as I say this, I am being shown <laughs> this television screen. Of this broadcast, I don't know what this is, but I get the sense you're connected to it. What's that mean? Well, my dad, he was a chief engineer of a TV radio station for 20 years. I basically grew up in a radio TV station, and I've had a connection. I've been on a couple different TV shows. Wow. High five. All right. So that's his confirmation. (laughs) To go at once. That's the confirmation. Yes. Go at once. But anyway, okay. Marcy, thank you for sharing your time with me. Oh, Lord, thank you so much. I'm so glad I got to talk to you. Yeah, it's a pleasure talking to you, too. And if you'd like to be my special guest caller like Marcy, sign up at RadioMediumLarley.com. And if you haven't already, subscribe and share our show on any podcast forum. It is free. <laughs>